this type of condition uh, is a very rare one. A lot of people in my community think that my hands are bad on me, or the result of witchcraft. Eh, sasa, wakaniabia ni yede huko kwa mugaga. All I want is to have a regular hands to be able to work for myself and my family. Now this is how I hold my brush. It is very hard for me to grip it, as you can see. Uh, the worst thing with living with all your disease is that you get uh, your condition is just worsening each day by day. 23-year-old Haroon was born with a rare skeletal disorder known as Olia disease, which causes abnormal bone development. It has affected my shoulder. As you can see, there is a lot of uh, big growth here and uh, my hands, as you can just see, they have to wear those clothes that uh, they are elastic. Yeah, it is hard to walk as I feel pain here when I walk. Yeah, especially in a long distance when I, and uh, when I start for a long time. It, is, it has been very hard for me to live in such a condition. Hi, ma'am. Hey. How are oh, you? Oh, fine. How are you? Fine, fine. Okay, fine. thank you. Thank yeah. you for visiting. You can just have a seat. Yeah. Have a seat. Na sasa, ha kukua mesariwa ifi, alikuwa mesariwa kama mkono hii yagu mzuri. Arafu ikaansa kitu kidogo kidogo ifi kwa joint kidogo kidogo ifi. E, sasa, wakaniabia ni niede niede huko kwa mugaga sasa nikawaambia siedi pahari i started uh, having complications at the age of 7 years Haroon was diagnosed when he was 6 and has had a number of surgeries to try and treat his condition but each time the problem has returned more severely you can imagine how hard it is the growth come back after the surgery uh, right now I'm not receiving any kind of medical treatment because uh, I will be willing to have the treatment, but I don't have those funds to receive that kind of treatment. I do come from a very humble background. In such a way, uh, we are poor. We don't live in a stable life. I live with a friend of mine who took me in. I had no place to go. I was living by then on the street. <laughs> I've been cooking food for me, making tea, uh, make sure that uh, I have uh, the, the basic need be available on my side. He has been a good friend to me, and I'm very grateful to have such a friend. We are actually preparing ourselves to go to the marketplace where there is a lot of people. Actually, it is a challenge. There is a lot of judging. A lot of people in my community think that my hands are bad on me. Or the result of witchcraft, or I am cursed. Actually, they say, there they are those who would say that uh, I should be uh, one of those actors in a horror movie. When people say such a thing to me, you feel depressed. So this is where I come to the market and you, as you can see people around here they are just staring at me. Yeah. Some, some treat him with fear. You can see him when they run away. But most of us we treat him like our brother. My biggest wish is to get the right treatment from the right doctor so that I can live a, a regular life. Haroon hopes to be able to train as a journalist in the future to help raise awareness about people who are living in challenging situations such as himself. People are inspired by the way I deal with my condition. All I want is to have a regular hands to be able to work for myself and my family. I'm still dreaming. I have not kept my dream down 